Hey everybody, this is Cappy Smack coming to you from Vega Conflict. And this weekend, you're not going to see many videos come out of me because I'm doing this uh, Axis event. I did some preview videos. Now I'm doing the Axis event, and uh, I've got so far after just about a day, got one hour left, uh, an hour and 40 minutes left before we get out of this first day. I've got 1.4, almost 1.5 million points. After the first day, it is a four-day event, We're engaging. and I have been doing nothing but hitting the lowest level trash mobs that I can find. This is a Reaper 45, I just did a Reaper 40, and I've been doing that non-stop with my fleet. I'll show you the action. My little fleet is pretty pathetic. It's a level 69 fleet, I've got three Mark I Punishers that I bought and I've uh, got a domination carrier that's got some Xenotech and I just farm these on auto so the computer's doing all the work and um, I can do this for maybe an hour or two before I have to repair anything And then my repair is costing about 120 coins. I bought 4,000 coins for the event. I've got about 3,100 coins left. And let me just show you the prizes. The main prize is this Paladin Carrier. Paladin Carrier, and I'm getting lucky with uh, getting Reaper 45s in this one little area. So it's a Paladin Carrier. It's really super cool. Top of the line, Axis, Tech. But what I also need is that plus one of these three modules that are 300,000 points each. And after I've got that for 2.3 million, I'll need six of these Hunter Swarm 3s for another 1.5 million points. But at my current pace of just doing trash mobs, I'll have uh, maybe 6 million points. What I really need is 3.8 million. So I'm just about at the end of day one, and I'll put a video in at the end of day two, and the end of day three, and at the end of day four, I will show all of the uh, rewards. That many rewards from hitting these trash mobs, it's just intel points. You can see here, intel stolen. But I can do these uh, repeatedly without having to repair my fleets. And so it's a pretty low cost way to farm the materials I need for the top of the line equipment. Now I won't be able to build a paladin for at least a month or two. Because my base sucks because I just started the game. We're engaging. But eventually I'll be able to build a top-of-the-line fleet with Paladin Carrier and with Xenotech ships, which is currently top-of-the-line for the game. So I just wanted to say what I was doing. Please uh, like and subscribe and, you know, smash the like button and share the video. And uh, let's keep it going. This is Cappy Smack, signing off.